What up, Hard Squad? Today, I'll be giving you a sneak preview of the newest Pokemon TCG set, Rebel Clash, by opening up a VMAX Rising Booster Box. VMAX Rising was released earlier this month, and inside this box are the almost exact same artworks that will be seen in the English Pokemon TCG set Rebel Clash, which officially comes out for us on May 1st of this year. I'm excited about that set and I will be doing early openings of Rebel Clash, but in the meantime, we have a absolute gorgeous box to open with some surprises that you are going to love. And if you love this video, Heart Squad, please, Hit that thumbs up button. Let's get this video to 5,000 likes. So hit that thumbs up. Let's take a look at the box. We got Sir Fetched. I salute you, sir. We have a Growlithe. Kind of random. I think it's a Duraludon. And I, I'll tell you straight off the bat, I have played Pokemon Sword and Shield and beaten it. Uh, as far as all the names of the Pokemons, I'm still working on them. So just a forewarning. There's a little mini surprise, yes. Natu and Zatu make their return in this set. And we're gonna pull plenty of it. Natu's, how do you do's, are gonna happen. Helioptile and of course, Gyarados. And there goes all PSA 10s. There is nothing on the bottom, so we uh, let's get right into this. Wait, did I get the front? Okay, there's nothing. So there are three chase cards as I struggle to open this up that we want to pull in this set. Frost Moth, Secret Rare, Gold Card, Full Art, whatever you want to officially call it. Um, there is a Big Charm Secret Rare card and the one I want to pull the most a secret rare twin energy card going for around $80 at the moment. And this box took weeks and weeks to get to me. So I apologize. Wow, this is also not wanting to open up. I apologize as I want to somewhat preserve the box. There we go. I ordered this like before the even set came out and it was stuck in customs for weeks and weeks. And I'm just like, you know what? It'll get to us. We'll get to it. So I thank y'all so much for your patience, Heart Squad. All right, so here are all the packs, or at least the first half. All of the arts are the exact same for everyone. I gotta say, these are absolutely gorgeous, which leads us to the question of the day. Which of these Pokemon is your favorite? Inteleon, Cinderace, or Rillaboom? Gotta go with the hashtag Grookey Gang Rillaboom, so that's what I'm gonna comment in the comment section. But it's up to y'all to let me know. But um, let's go ahead, put this over there. Cinderace has got a little pose you're striking. All right, let's get let's get into this box. I don't even know how much the box costs at this point. There's only five cards, I believe, and I think that's the card trick. So. I wanna go a little bit slower just at the beginning because this is gonna be art that you are gonna be seeing in Rebel Clash, the English Pokemon TCG set coming out May. And so far, I'm liking it. Be free, butter free. I think that's an Indeedy, otherwise known as a creepy Five Nights at Freddy's animatronic. I, I just, it's creepy and it's sweeping dirt. It is literally sweeping dirt right now. Who does that? See, it's a Five Nights Fetish Genetronic. All right, Grubbin. Nothing really more to that. I think it's just like digging in the ground. Is that a bravery in the back? I think it is. Bunnelby loves the pudding. And oh my gosh, it right off the bat. We pulled my favorite of the three, a Rillaboom. Doom, 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 doom. V Max. That is awesome and beautiful and stunning and brave and whatever else you want to call it. That seriously is a gorgeous card and I'm very, very happy about that. Prices will be on the screen uh, because prices are changing and I'm recording this a little bit ahead of time and I uh, want to make sure I put the right prices. I think it's maybe worth around $8. It could be more, it could be less. Uh, but what a start. What a start indeed. Brongzong. Pretty cool. It's in the prairie or wherever you want to call it. Uh, Hunedge. And there he is, Galarian Farfetch'd. 
He's unibrow. He's got a unibrow. I'm pretty sure that's a unibrow. That's what Mr. Bean would say. There's Caterpie. Interesting to see a Caterpie outside at nighttime. But whatever floats your boat, Caterpie. I'm pretty sure that's called an, um, an abundant bucket. Yes, it's a water bucket. So I'm probably just going to call it water bucket. For some reason, I can't say the words abundant today. And that is it. So all of that for that one pack. All right, all right. I will get moving, but honestly, you got to just admire and respect the illustrations for these cards because I am very, very much so loving this, especially if we can get one of the gold cards. Obama bomb snow, how you doing? Char bug, Nintendo GameCube otherwise. Oh, that's so cute. Look at Volpix, you are so cute. There's another night at the Roxbury Caterpie. Uh, Caterpie, I think that's a twin energy. I'm gonna go ahead and think that's twin energy. I know some of the names for some of the trainers. And like I said, not all the Pokemon I will be pronouncing right. <laughs> Uh, but I'll try my best. Um, see, like, I, I forgot that one off the top of my head. It's something with, I think, Ara, that's Aracuda. Aracuda! Oh god, that is so creepy. Galarian Mr. Mime. I'm sorry, when I do raids in the game, and this thing is prancing and dancing, that's creepy. It's almost as creepy as the ND- It's creepier than the NDD Five Nights at Freddy's animatronic. Nintendo GameCube, Bronzor, hey, an Inteleon V. You know, I just, I love the name Inteleon because of, you know, Leon, but the design of him, I'm still just getting used to, but it's not too bad. It's not too bad. So, so far, I am very, very happy with the pulls because we pulled a Rillaboom VMAX card, hence VMAX Rising. Hopefully I said the words VMAX Rising earlier. That is the name as a gorgeous Ninetales. Mama Gugumu with the sunrise or sunset, or it's on Mars because it can obviously breathe. It, it's just a beast. It's a beautiful card. Stunky. Do the stunky leg. Barnacle. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna forget about that one. Oh my gosh, I didn't know you can get multiple of them. A Cinderace VMAX. How about that? I had no idea you can get multiple VMAXs. I'm so happy. Now, let's go for Inteleon. Hopefully it's not like guaranteed because they're on the box like that, but uh, I'm very, very happy about that. Cinderace, VMAX, Rillaboom, VMAX, and we technically already pulled Inteleon with the V Ultra Rare card, wink, wink. Let's keep it going. Let's make this the best. Oh, you know things are serious. When you pull Shuckle. Look at that face. Where's that been? All right, so Shuckle. <gasps> Magikarp Army! I seriously am loving the illustrations with this set. Look at Pikachu. It's fat-faced Pikachu. Oh my gosh. All right, so uh, we got a little hashtag Magikarp Army action. Still waiting on a, what's it called? Uh, Natu, how do you do? That is what I am waiting. Uh, what's it called? This lady has a full art, I believe, in this set, which is actually a pretty cool looking card. Um, maybe we'll pull it. I don't know, because I don't know the pull rates. All right, let's continue with this. Helioptile, Snover. Whose shoes are those? Interesting. Halmucha, Halucha. And there she is again. Is it snowing or, oh, those are like flower petals or something. Okay, I'll just like put some clothes on here. I'm gonna show you all the pools. I'm like, I'm very happy about this. Uh, so these are what they're gonna look like in the American Rebel Clash set. We're pulling them now, ladies and gentlemen. All right, if you missed yesterday's video, it will be in the eye as well. As please be sure to subscribe to the channel if you want to subscribe, basically. You don't have to if you don't want to. Otherwise, just come on. There's a Galarian Corsola. It's kind of sad. Oh, okay. Is that a Barbarical? Oh, uh, yeah. Please consider subscribing if you have not. By the time this video is up, we are very, very close to 800,000 subscribers. So hit that thumbs up button, guys. Don't forget 5,000 likes for this video. 5,000 likes for us. Hopefully hitting 800,000 subscribers in the very, very near future. Like, I'm talking days. And, oh, 
Our first holographic. I salute you, so fetched. I feel like just eating hummus. Wait, you can say it like that. Hummus with um, some of that. Yeah, whatever his sword is. I'll just take that. So that was the first holographic pull. I like it. Like, I want holographics to be difficult to pull because it reminds me of the older sets. Granted, the older sets, that was the only cool things that you can pull were the holographics. But you know what? You know what I'm talking about. I think that's called Burning Scarf. What gave it away? I don't know. Probably the graphics. There is uh, not Toxtricity, but I think it's just called like Tox. I think, maybe? Grubbin? And there's the Mario. I'm basically just gonna call this Pokemon Super Mario because that is exactly what it reminds me of. I think it was like in Super Mario 3. <laughs> oh, great! I think that's Appleton. Lots of apples for this guy. I don't know how it moves. It doesn't even have eyes. But it's a hollow right after I said, let's make hollows rare. You whooping in do. All right, I'm having way too much fun with this today. Uh, let's continue with a shuckle. He's back for vengeance. All right, uh, there's that whole line of which I'm completely forgetting about. I did not know there was a some type of Metapod. Something has happened to Metapod to where he now looks like that. <laughs> there, there's Diggersby. He loves to put in. I really, really do not like Diggersby for some reason. Just a really creepy Pokemon, especially in the game. All right, all right, let's continue with that. Let's... Uh, Cramorant doing his weird stuff that he usually does. Give me that stunky leg. Where? Oh, there it is. I was about to say, where are all the Natus? Yes, there is something shiny behind this, probably a hollow, but let's just admire in one, two, three, say it, Natu. How do you do? Hey, there he is. You were on the box earlier. How you doing? Duralodon. All right, so there's Natu. How do you do? Loving it. I'm loving it. All right. I'm loving these pulls so far. We have gotten a lot of more hollows recently. And two VMAX cards. Those are pretty cool. Oh, Arcanine. That is a really, really cool looking card. So Arcanine. Uh oh. I think there's another V Ultra Rare card. Maybe another Nazi. That would be cool. <gasps> hey! Cinderace V. We're pulling him in all shapes and forms in this video. Now we just need Inteleon V Max, and our dreams will have cometh trueth. But until then, we get more Diggers B, who loves the pudding. Hilalisk. There's indeedy brushing dirt for some reason. There's a really happy, I think it's Aracuda. There's Training Court. When I first saw this card, I really, really liked it. One, because that's my, you know, my childhood house. That's Leon the Galar Galar Region Champion. That's it, that was my house. And so, it, but it, honestly, it's a really cool looking card and it's called Training Court. Love it, awesome, good, moving on. Not a holographic. Still waiting, I like, there are some pretty cool hyper rare, rainbow rares, whatever you want to call them in the set. So really, really hoping. Is this the full time we have pulled Aegislash? I think we have, dang. All right, Grubbin, Vulpix. Yeah, we're just gonna skip you. Hey, oh man, why am I having a brain fart right now? Like I, oh, I'm sorry guys, I'm completely, Turfield Stadium. It's like such a simple name too. That's usually what happens like, when people, you like start doing Pokemon card opening channels, you like reach out to me and you're like, I just gotta say, I have so many brain farts while doing it. How do you do it, Leonhart? And I'm like, I don't, cause you just saw me forget his name right now. <laughs> Ooh, there's something shiny. I'm gonna remember it right as I hit the off button for recording, I'm telling you. The blade, Tox or whatever. Oh my gosh! You looking at nice, a full art Sonia. Gosh, that was one of the cards I was wanting to pull uh, in the back of my head because I completely forgot about it. Oh, uh, that's a gorgeous looking card. Very, very happy. This box couldn't be going any better right now. Let us take a look at these 
fantabulous pulls. Look, look at that, two VMAX. How do you get, how do you get that? I'm just excited about it. Whatever these cards are worth, it doesn't matter at this point because the whole point of this is to show you what the Rebel Clash set is eventually gonna look like. Plus, Japanese cards are awesome. Look at the back. And they're much better quality than English ones. But I'm sorry for burping on the screen. <laughs> Toxtricity, everybody. I opened up the uh, Toxtricity box a few days ago. That video maybe will be in the eye. Otherwise, just go to the front page of my channel if you wanna go check out that box. Okay, so I think this is called like Impidimp. I think. Don't quote me on that. Because how this video has been going, probably wrong. But I gotta say, I am like so stuck, like in the middle. Do I like this Pokemon line? Like, I think the final evolution is called like Grimmsnarl or something. Guys, let me know in the comment section. Do you like this guy? <laughs> really creepy. Mucho Halucha and a holographic Gyarados. Something about like every set should have a Magikarp in it. Like Gyarados, you don't have to. But a Magikarp, especially with a little like Big Cheeks Pikachu, you, you gotta have it, you gotta have it. So, all right, let's continue on. We've got plenty of packs to go, even though they just have five cards on the inside. Uh, but I gotta say, I've been having so much fun. There's the second evolution, who uh, it more, it's like Morgrem. I think it's called Morgrem. So there you go, there's an A for effort for that one. And Turfield Stadium, actually trainer card. Why am I forgetting that gym guy's name? Like, you can ask me after this video and... Is it like, Tim? <laughs> no, I'm kidding. It's something, it's something. Okay, well, that's about uh, even creepier than I can all ever imagine, so we're just gonna kind of skip that. Uh, Super Mario, how you doing? Mucho Halucha. There's that guy again. And oh, he's back. So, far, I'm hoping there is still a chance to pull a rainbow rare or a secret rare. I believe there is. I don't think it's guaranteed for box or anything, but uh, twin energy, I choose you. Mr. Mime and Sanaconda. He's spitting up a hairball in the desert. So Sanaconda V, pretty cool. Nothing too crazy with that one, but it is cool to uh, just to keep on checking out the new art. What's gonna be? I gotta say like that box is absolutely beautiful. We're just gonna put the box up. All right, let's see what we can do in this one. I'm still hoping for something that just is absolutely incredible, even though the Sonya card was, the full art one is gorgeous. Absolute gorgeous card, and I'm very, very happy about that pull. The two VMAX cards. Uh, Cramorant, ooh, there's something. Wait, it's a Natu! How do you do? It's pretty rare. This is only the second time we pulled them, guys. Magikarp, yeah. There he is again. Oh, 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 I think that's the Grimmsnarl one. Very creepy, especially when you do a raid. That thing, really big, flopping around. Leaves little to the imagination with that comment. All right, so there he is. Holographic, how many packs we got left? Like, I really just like, sometimes don't even wanna open up some of the packs. They just are that, like, they feel good. Good, strong quality packs and they're very nice looking, so. All right, still holding out hope for a Rainbow Hyper Rare. So, I knew the other name, I believe, uh, Appleton. I think it's the Apple something. Just, now I wanna go eat an apple. The Blade, Vicavolt, Holographic. So the holographics are about the same for what I would see in any other Japanese box, uh, but still pretty cool to see the new arts for those. Zerzi is Zatu. You don't have to say not to for that one though. What do you do for this one, Natu? How do you do? It's just very nice when you when you pull that Magikarp army, and there he is again. I'll just say Stonehenge in the back for that one. So, all right, all right, all right. Calm down, calm down. We're gonna get some good stuff very, very soon. Age of Slash, Metapod, diseased Metapod, I guess you could say, and there is a Galarian. Yeah, so there it is, holographic. I know it's Corsola, so. All right, let us continue with this. Okay, don't want to damage the card. There's going to be a gold card in this pack. Put in my call in right now. Gold card, be free, butter free. That's only the second time pulling that. Grelith, Aracuda, Apple. Whoa, 
Oh, okay, I was like, what is she doing? How is she taller than the house? What is this, a house for ants? So it's a trainer card. I'm guessing it's just the regular Sonia trainer card. So, all right, let's uh, see what we can do. How do you do? I feel like pulling another nut too. Uh, I think we got like four packs left. There's Galarian, Farfetch'd, Impidimp, Bronzor, Rillaboom V. Very, very nice looking card. V, the V is for very. Uh, we have three packs. So, guess we're about to find out if we get a Rainbow Rare. Quick reminder, guys, if you are new to the channel, please do consider subscribing and hit that thumbs up button. Let's get this video. 5,000 likes. Shuckle, pack one last time. That's the third trilogy. And Burning Scarf. Down to the final two packs. Hoping for something good. Rainbow Rare, Secret Rare, but we get a Digger's B once again. Galarian, Corsola, Vulpix, and there's that one once again. So another holographic. I think that's our, is that the only repeat holographic that we've gotten all day? Not too shabby, not too, not too shabby. Alrighty then, let us uh, begin with the final pack. Let's get some last pack magic. Arcanine, Aracuda, Bronzor. Oh, and it's a trading court. Overall, love the pulls in this video, but if you wanna see more openings, check out the videos right over there. My name is Leanheart, stay awesome, stay positive, and as always, I will see y'all in the next video.